There was a Zen teacher who said that you should bring a beginner's mind to each meditation. In other words, be open to all kinds of possibilities. And that's partly true. You do want to bring fresh eyes to the breath each time you sit down. But you also want to bring your expert's mind. In other words, bring your experience in the past, what you've learned from the past, what works, what doesn't work. Bring that to bear as well. That's what mindfulness is for. We've remembered lessons from the past, either things we've heard or things we've experienced ourselves as to what works, what doesn't work. And those lessons are always valid, especially the big lessons about putting an end to suffering, learning to recognize the causes of suffering inside. Some of the details may change from time to time, but the basic principles are always applicable. So you don't want to forget those. Otherwise, you just thrash around in the present moment, trying this, trying that, this may work, that may work, and then you forget about it. And that kind of meditation doesn't go anywhere. We're trying to develop a skill. A skill takes experience, and the lessons you learn each time you meditate. So be willing to learn the lessons, and then learn how to apply what you've learned from the past. Now, sometimes some ideas you picked up from the past may not be working right now. But you'll know that when you try them out and say, oh, these, these things don't work. That's when you try to look with new eyes. But an expert's eyes can see potentials where a beginner would have no idea that they might be there. I remember seeing a film one time of a Japanese artist. He was a living national treasure, and he did paper cutouts. And he sketched a few designs, and they looked like little children's designs. And I was wondering why he was a national treasure. But then within those little sketches, he saw potentials that I, watching the film, couldn't see. The finished product he came up with was very beautiful. So the expert can also see things that the beginner can't see at all. So try to have fresh eyes, but also experienced eyes as you come to the breath. That way the meditation is good in the present moment, but it's also good over the long term. It develops into a genuine skill. <laughs>